It's like Casey. I do look like Casey. Do you think we look alike? A little bit. I'm back. Okay, so I know you guys missed me, but um, before I start, I just want to say that Casey has a little gift for all of you guys at the end who's watching this. So I want to make sure that you guys stay till the end just to get that because it's a really big gift. So just wait till the end. Today I'm going to be talking about how to know if a girl is into you. And before I start, I want to say to all the 50 year olds complaining about me being on camera and wanting to hear from like a real older woman, half of Casey's demographic is literally like teenage boys and like young men. So you're not the only one that we're thinking about and um, I just need you to suck it up and either go to another video or back off because I'm talking to 50% of Casey's demographic, not you guys. Moving on, to know if a girl's into you, the first thing is a girl will make it extremely obvious if she's not into you. Like, you will know. So if you're sitting there debating if she is or isn't, um, she most likely is not. And even though girls are confusing, and I do agree with that, 50% of the time, if she's giving you absolutely zero energy, she's most likely not interested in you, and that's just a fact. So again, girls will make it very obvious if they're not interested in you. The first way to know if a girl really is interested in you, in my opinion, I feel like if a girl holds solid eye contact with you, whether you're in a group, um, on a date, alone, doesn't matter, just hanging out, if she is genuinely interested in what you have to say, holds eye contact, has a genuine, real conversation with you, and doesn't like go off and uh, glaze over, she's most likely interested in you in some sort of way or just wants to get to know you to see if she will become interested in you. So the number one way to see if a girl um, likes you, I guess I could say, is if she holds eye contact and really listens to what you're saying and has a real genuine conversation with you. And even if she doesn't care what you're saying, she will pretend to care. So that's like another good way to tell. That's why like too, um, if a girl, like even if you're bad at making jokes or anything like that and you make terrible jokes, but like a girl will consistently laugh at what you're saying, it's because she wants you to feel good. So like keep that in mind. Like she'll give you attention if she thinks you're high value enough to give attention to. Another good way to tell if girls are interested in you is if she laughs at what you say. And this is gonna sound really generic and really basic. Girls in general are very bubbly and they kind of laugh at everything, but most of the time, if they're interested in you, they will pretend like you are the funniest person in the world. So you could be an absolute like disgrace. Like you, you could be the dumbest person she knows and she will laugh at you to make you feel validated so that you know that she's interested. It's just how it works. Yeah, if she laughs at what you say, even if it's not funny, she might have some sort of interest in you. Okay, this one's a really good one. Um, it's my number one way that I think that um, a guy can tell if a girl is interested in them. If her demeanor completely changes when you're in a group versus when you're alone. So again, let's say you hang out with girls and guys in a friend group and she is talkative. She feels comfortable. She's laughing. She's talking. She's bubbly, whatever. And then it switches and you two are alone and she's nervous and she's shy and she's a little bit scared to talk. She's not as outgoing she 100% has some sort of interest in you because why would she be nervous to be alone with you if she didn't look at you as something other than a friend? You know what I'm saying? So yeah, pretty much if her demeanor changes from like outgoing to shy and nervous when she's around you, then you know that she has some sort of interest in you. Lastly, the number one thing as a man is that you should always be pursuing the woman. If you're not pursuing her, it most likely will not work out because girls want to be pursued. We want the guy to take the initiative. We want them to be assertive, which I know is overused now, but we just want to see confidence. And girls in general, which is annoying, we're usually shy um, when it comes to if we like a guy. So if you're sitting there debating if a girl likes you or not, and you're waiting for her to make a move, or you're waiting for her to ask you to go on a date or hang out, whatever it is, it most likely will not happen. Just because that girl has made in subtle ways her obvious interest in you and she's waiting for you to pursue her. So if you're not taking that and, and gaining your confidence and asking her on dates or asking her out or trying to get to know her, nothing will happen. So pretty much what I'm saying is if you want a girl and you really like a girl and you wanna know if she likes you, you gotta man up and you just gotta ask her out. I know it's scary, I know it can be scary, but when you do it, that shows confidence, it shows that you really like her, and um, it will get you farther than waiting around wondering. Okay, a really good way that could help you guys recognize and 
just get better at seeing these signs on your own is getting Casey's masculinity blueprint. Um, he's having a huge Black Friday sale right now. It's, I think, over 75% off, 70% off, something like that. But it's literally the biggest sale that he's ever had. So you guys need to check that out right now. So again, go check out Casey's Masculinity Blueprint to get better at talking to girls and knowing the signs on when they like you or not. All right, I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Now, as you guys can see, this is seriously the first time I've ever done anything like this. Okay, my entire life's work, my entire product, my entire community, everything I've ever built, is inside of this product and right now if anything has held you back before from getting it now is seriously the best time to equip yourself with the best process forever